So someone wanted to know about ictal nystagmus. And if someone has nystagmus seizure, ictal, it's probably not gonna be the top of your differential diagnosis. You really have to make sure there's no structural lesion causing this or medications. The most common thing that I see nystagmus in in patients who are, have seizure is their medicines. So that's the treatment of the disease that is actually causing their nystagmus and not the seizure itself. However, some patients have had nystagmus documented during the ictus, which is during the seizure activity. And that's interesting because seizure usually has got this cortical focus and that's why you have a seizure. And in the ocular motor system, we've got the frontal eye fields and the parietal occipital temporal for the pursuit and the frontal eye field is for saccade. And so when you have a seizure in the frontal eye field, that is an irritative focus. So an irritative focus will increase the electrical activity. And because it's the contralateral frontal eye field that controls the saccade, if I want to look to the right, it's my left frontal eye field that's actually firing. And therefore, if you have electricity in your left frontal lobe, that's an irritative lesion that will drive the eyes to the right. So you'll get a gaze deviation. And so some of these patients have a compensatory movement back to normal. So the fast phase of nystagmus is actually the compensatory phase for whatever the bad thing that's happening is. It is the slow phase that is taking the fovea off of the target. That slow phase drift is compensated by a contralateral horizontal jerk beating fast phase to the opposite direction. That's to get the fovea back on the target. And so when we see seizure related eye movement problems, normally it's gaze deviation. If it's irritative, it'll be push the eyes to the contralateral side because the frontal eye field. If it's a destructive lesion, then you can't look to the right, then your eyes will be driven to the left. So a destructive lesion in the left frontal lobe will not be able to direct the saccade to the right, and therefore the right frontal lobe will be directing the eyes to the left. And so destructive lesions and irritative lesions in the frontal eye field do the opposite. And so the nystagmus could be either way, depending on whether there's a structural lesion causing the seizure, like a hemorrhage or a tumor, or if it's just electrical activity, the ictal version. But please make sure there's no structural lesion. Please make sure that it's not their medicines. And if you see an ictal uh, nystagmus, you should probably make a video of it.